Hi everybody, Troy Anderson back again from Anderson Training Systems Fitness Coaching Business here in Tempe. Uh, I've got another blog, video blog for you today. Uh, this is a topic that it's been, it's a few weeks old, um, about a little over a month old, but I had to talk about it and I've actually shared the video uh, of it below so you guys can hopefully be as disgusted as, about it as I am. Uh, a few weeks back, early May I think it was, uh, Kirsty Alley was back on Oprah and as fat as ever again. And it was just absolutely ridiculous. I was actually having, I, don't, I have no idea how I ended up watching this crap. Um, I call it crap TV. My wife like gravitates towards it. Sometimes I end up watching it. I have no idea. But I, I, in the in result, I get there and sometimes I see crap like this. Um, but she was on there. She's massive again. She you know, did the Ginny Craig thing and was the spokesperson, blah, 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 blah. And the next thing you know, we see her on there. So they do this whole thing. It was like a whole hour-long show. And, of course, Oprah's no freaking better. She's, you know, up and down and up and down and up and down. And all that means, really, and we'll get to this point later, is that they don't know why the hell they're doing it. They have no clue. And so if you don't have a clue on why you're doing it, then it's easy just to flitter away like they do. They get too busy, they get to run too many businesses, blah, blah, blah. I've seen it happen a million times. But here's a few notes. I got my trusty uh, note-taking book out here. I actually took some notes that day. She has zero accountability. She wants to do it her own way. She wants to do all kinds of crazy. It was straight out of her mouth. She doesn't want to have any consequences. She, um, it was amazing. You've got to pull your head out of the mud and be able to do this. Everybody says, oh, if I was like Oprah, I could have a chef and, and a nutritionist and blah, blah, blah. But people, you don't get it. You don't need that stuff. You don't need that stuff to be successful. And obviously, that kind of stuff, it doesn't matter because those people do the same thing that everybody in everyday walks of life do. It's because they don't know why. Um, it's, it, it's absolutely amazing. One of my client notes, I actually kept a note from her from our discussion on the computer, is that she wrote, her issue is her legs and butt, question mark, question mark, question mark. She's fat everywhere. She's in, she is in real denial. That is an exact quote. I didn't make that up. Um, so, just the point, I've done consults where people were, I've actually told them, asked them the question, do you really know what you want to get out of this? Because if you don't, I don't recommend you start any kind of exercise program, let alone taking the time and effort and commitment to the accountability and the personal relationship and the, and the money um, involved with working with a coach. It doesn't make a bit of sense. It's not going to stick. So you've got to find the reason. We just had a little discussion in boot camp earlier this week. People are kind of struggling with their goals. It has to mean something to you. Okay? If it means something to you, you will make it happen whether you're Oprah with a bazillion dollars and can buy all the things you want or whether you're the poorest, most non-knowledgeable, don't have internet access person out there. Think about it. You can get the job done on very basic premises. We don't see people in, in countries or places where there's not a lot of food being very fat, where it's not so damn easy. So this is not an easy effort of, of losing weight, getting fit, gaining performance levels, whatever it may be. So you but you have to find why it is for you. And it has to be deep down inside the heart. So Troy Anderson, AndersonTrainingSystems.com. Swing over there. Hopefully you enjoyed this. Check the video out below. It will obviously make you just wretch. And the other thing besides that, this is what really gets me is that she is coming out with a nutrition supplement line and she's hawking that crap. Because that's how she's going to do it. She lost, I don't know what, she came on the show and lost 10 pounds in 20 days or some crap thing. Uh, I'll put you in my garage with dog food and water in my whole weight room and you'll lose way more than that, okay? So don't buy into it. She's trying to take people's money. Stay away from all the, the celebrity stuff. Focus on you. Focus on how you're going to get the job done and what you're going to do. Keep positive attitude and we'll talk to you soon.